Hey everyone, this is Josh Galvin with Tizish.com. On this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can customize your website, your homepage, to only show categories from a certain category here or to exclude certain categories here. So here's what I mean by that. Um, see these blog postings. By default, your blog postings show the latest postings you've done regardless of the category. It's going to show the most it's going to show the most recent by date. All right. And now let's just say you wanted you didn't want the category called business of the month to show up in your home page uh, recent postings for any reason. All right. Regardless. Or maybe you want to only show the category business of the month here. Well, you could choose to have that be the case in your in your admin panel by doing the following that I teach you in this tutorial. So first, I'm going to show you how to remove a category's postings from showing up on your home page recent postings list alright so the first thing you do is go to your admin panel and then go to your categories page your categories page is found under posts under categories when you're in this category page what you need to do is the following click on the category that you want to remove first so let's say business of the month let's say we're gonna remove that what you need to do is click onto the business of the month link and then at the very top of the URL you see the URL here it's gonna end with an ID number ID equals and then this number whatever this number is you need to copy that number and now don't touch anything here go on to, on your left hand side go under appearance and then go to edit Tizish options edit Tizish theme options click on that and now here under te edit Tizish theme options what you have to do is simply scroll down to the part that says home page options include exclude categories from home page list and here's what you do if you want to exclude a category simply paste the category you want to exclude so we have 99 from that we, that we pasted and to exclude it put a minus sign in front of it so that's saying exclude category ID number 99 and since the since the category that we had done that we had looked at earlier the business the business deal um, business of the month category this is category ID number 99 that's saying to remove this category from the home page here so let's go back to our edit to this options we have minus 99 which means remove 99 and we scroll down and now we're gonna hit update Tizish options after this updates we could go to our home page this is how it was before notice that business of the month is here as the second post but today's demo beach report when I hit refresh it's gonna be removed and there you go so you see now how business uh, of the month is no longer in this home page see how these are all different ones well now let's pretend let's pretend you want to remove an extra one let's pretend you want to remove two categories let's say you're like I don't want my featured postings showing up in my home page for whatever reason well here's what you would do same thing go find your featured postings you click on it you're gonna get the category ID I see that this one has a category ID of 109 so what you can do is copy 109 and now in your Tizish options you're going to go to the same place you had minus 99 but this time hit a comma and now do minus and paste the code that you want so basically a comma with the minus signs means you could exclude multiple categories so I'm minus 99 comma minus 109 which is going to now remove the featured postings from this list so now I scroll down I hit update Tizish options and I'm all set so now if we go here when I hit refresh we're gonna see the featured postings disappear from this list And oh, actually, you know, for this site, I forgot. That's let's not do the featured postings because pretty much all the blog postings I put as featured postings. So let's just pretend we wanted to remove the the uh, bank owned homes postings because that was the last one. So let's get the category ID from this one. This one's 102. I'm just gonna go faster now. So instead of 109, instead of minus 109 and minus 99, we'll put minus 99 and minus 102. So I'm going to go ahead and hit update Tizish options. So now when I hit refresh,
when I hit refresh, we now see that these are only this now is not going to include the bank owned. See how the bank owned one is now gone from the bottom? Because that's the category we decided to remove, bank owned homes, as well as business of the month. So the whole point is you need the category IDs and then to exclude any of them, just put a minus sign as you see here with the category ID, minus and then comma with another one if you want to do multiple. Now let's say you want to make your blog posting only show one category, right? So now we did the excluding style. Let's do it now if we include only one blog posting. So let's say we only want it to be the business, uh, the business of the month, which was category 99. Here's what you do: remove the minus sign, and let's remove, let's remove everything else. So now we're saying only make your homepage show up, show this category, which is 99, category 99. So without a minus sign, it's going to make it only show that category. So we go to Update Tizish Options. And now here on our home page, when I hit Refresh, you're going to see it's going to only show the business of the month. There it goes. Now it's only showing the business of the month category. Now let's say you want to now have it include only two categories instead of exclude two categories. Well, what you do is go back here, and I'm sure you already know what's coming up next. You hit comma, and now just type in the next one, 102, which was that was the bank owned homes one. So now we have 99 and 102 to only show those since we don't have minus signs in front of them. Now we scroll down, we hit update Tizish options, and now we go back to our home page, we hit refresh. And now, as we can see here, we have business of the month, and we also have the bank on home showing up only. All right, so that's how you use the feature to include or exclude only certain categories. My recommendation is to have your home page. I like the exclude function by default better. So if I want my home page to only to not show any blog postings, instead of making it, instead of putting all your categories here and saying only show all these categories, I like to say exclude only the specific category you're looking not to have shown up. Excluding tends to be easier so that way you don't have to do so many different categories showing up. All right. So that's everything for modifying your home page blog postings uh, which, or which ones up here actually. So if you have any questions go to facebook.com forward slash tizish and ask me there. All right. Well good luck and uh, have fun using the tool. Take care.